Hey everyone, this is Mike from All of It. Thanks again for tuning into our YouTube channel for another golf segment. Today we're going to talk about the bump and run. This is a basic golf shot that every golfer must have in order to be successful in safe strokes around the greens. Now, as with any golf shot, your setup is of paramount importance. Most people do a couple of things wrong. Most people don't play the ball far enough back in their stance for a bump and run. They don't have the ball far, the hand, their hands far enough forward and they don't have their stance at all situated properly. So we're gonna tackle those three things. So first of all, you wanna make sure you've got the ball off of your right foot for a bump and run. This enables you to strike down at the golf ball, keep it low to the ground, and minimize spin. Secondly, you wanna make sure that you turn your toes, both of your toes, slightly towards the target, maybe 20 or 30 degrees. This puts your weight in the right spot, turns your body towards the target, and allows you to follow through without generating a lot of power. The third thing is you want to make sure that your hands are slightly ahead of the golf ball. This ensures a downward strike and solid contact. The fourth thing is to make absolutely certain that your club face is square or even slightly closed. Most people, especially good players, tend to set up to their chips with the club face slightly open. That works on most chips, but on bump and run, it creates too much spin. And spin is your enemy on a bump and run. On a bump and run, you want the ball to react consistently every time, and spin is unpredictable. So, make sure you've got the ball off your right foot, turn your toes towards the target, keep your hands ahead of it with the club face square. Now that you've got your setup figured out, the swing is very simple. The swing is simply a putting stroke. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to set up the way we discussed. I'm gonna look at the target. I'm gonna look back at the ball and I'm going to take a stroke similar to the same length stroke I would take for a putt of the same distance. My setup has already gotten everything done for me here. Now all I need to do is take a rhythmical putting stroke and everything should work out. didn't quite go in but if you do this if you use this technique the ball is going to go up next to the hole a lot more often and you're going to save a lot of shots hey everyone thanks for tuning in if you like what you saw please subscribe to our youtube channel leave your comments in the comments section below for more great tips like this visit us at all of it.com